Kathy, this is Boyce. This should show you how to change the names and keep the sound and the apple crunch and the fading and all the automation. First thing I want you to do is go to your attachments tab. Go up to where it says biting apple sound. Do a right click, copy that sound, and then paste it on your desktop. Go back to your lesson. Choose a name. Go to grouping. Go to ungroup. Take the name out. Change the name. Place the name back. Regroup them. And this time, add your sound back by browsing to your desktop. Find your apple biting sound. Attach it, put it directly on it, attach. And then once again, go down to properties, go to object animation, go fade out. And I believe the fade out was fast or normal. I'm just going to leave it normal. Okay, so now when you click on it, you get the Apple sound and the fade out. I hope this helps.